pain. Yeah, just leave him. No, no, no. It's fine. I've already made breakfast. Here's your plate. I don't mind it. You need your rest. Still, we might have to get that checked. If you're sleeping for that long every day, then you might be coming down with something. Mm, I don't know. How long did you normally sleep before we got together? I'm talking about good nights when you weren't stressing out over battles. What about before you got together with that group? Like, when you were younger? See? Then that's not normal for you. Maybe you got caught something while we were out shopping. Are you sure? No coughs, fever, stomach aches? You should probably get a check down just in case. We can go to a doctor when I get back from work. Mm. Then what if I make you some soup later on? How does that sound? Mm. Oh, come on. We can't just let this go like that. What if it gets worse? Seriously, I'm worried that something is wrong, and if there is, then I want to make sure it gets taken care of. Can you please just let me take you to a doctor, just once? They've got stuff for everything. What could they possibly not treat? What? What kind of bad thoughts? Why can't you tell me? Honestly, I think it upsets me more that you're not telling me. If keeping those thoughts to yourself is causing all these problems, then you gotta let them all out. Otherwise, I can't help you. <sighs> Remember, we said we'd always be honest and let each other know if something is wrong. Because we're here for each other. And we want to make sure that things go smoothly between us. So that we can have someone to rely on. <laughs> yeah, so don't be afraid. I'm here to make things better. It's fine. Take your time. Oh. No, there's uh, nothing wrong with that. They were your friends, so it's um, normal to miss them. Uh, well, I wouldn't know for sure. They didn't like me very much, so I'm not sure that they thought that this would be the best if we put two and two together, and they realized that both of us went missing, you know? Even if they don't feel the same, you did your best to make sure you make good memories with them, no? So there's no need to feel guilty. You did everything that you could for them. You deserve some happiness for yourself. Hmm. I guess sometimes I miss not having any responsibilities when I'm still with my group. But it was probably going to happen anyway since it was all over. I was planning to live on my own close to one of our organization's bases. There were talks about promoting us to manage them at some point. It 
would have paid a lot more. There's no point in yearning for what could have been. What's done is done. You were worth it, you know? Being able to be with you is worth more than any friendships I've lost. And I don't mind doing the extra work to help us get by. As long as we're both happy, that's all that matters. Huh? What, what do you mean? Well, why would you think that? I told you it's all fine. I don't regret what I've done. I love you more than anything. I wasn't going to let either side tell me I couldn't. Burning bridges is just a part of that. There's nothing that can be done about it. No, you don't get it. I can't regret any of it. Otherwise, what's the point? I isn't it the same for you? Y you, you don't regret it, do you? Be honest. What? What mistake? Th there was no mistake here. What life I couldn't have doesn't matter. I chose to be here with you. There, there's no going back. I, I can't just walk up to them and ask for my old life again. That's not how that works. These opportunities are gone. It's over. There's nothing to gain from your friends either. They hate me. I can find other opportunities here. That way I can take care of both of us. No. No, you aren't going anywhere. You're not going to leave. You, you can't do that to me. It won't help anyone. You're just going to make it worse for both of us if you do. <laughs> I have lost my position. My friends. My future. I willingly gave up all that for you. No, <laughs> you don't get it. I'm happy with how things turned out. I got what I fought really hard for. It's fine. All the money and comfort in the world, all the greatest hardships I've ever had. I wanted you so much more than that. So, you have to stay. I can't give us something that's worth that much. You're all I have left. There's nothing else. Stop it, please. You didn't do anything wrong. Believe me, you made the best choice you could have. It'll only be a mistake if you leave me. There's no point dwelling in the past. Those people aren't our friends anymore. No real friend would force you to hate someone you love. It was awful seeing the organization hurt you like that. 
I'm just glad it's over. I can't forgive your side either. Those scars will never go away. No, I'm not trying to ruin your memory of them. But don't forget why we're here in the first place. I would be cautious of anyone else who claims to have your best interest at heart. I don't want us to have to run away again. I really like this town a lot. I don't think there's a safer place we could be. The organization's main base is a long ways away from here. I doubt either side plans to make that big of a detour in their fight. The only good that'll come out of finding out what happened in the end is that it'll reinforce our decision to run away from that life. There is no future for us there. Let's not make the mistake of being in that position ever again. All we need to do is to move past all that and make this the future we live for. I'll take care of you like I always do, and I want you to do the same for me. I want you to be the best lover you can possibly be. Keep sleeping next to me so I can wake up to see your face in the morning. Keep giving me a goodbye kiss whenever I leave to go to work. And when I get back, be there to greet me when I come back home with the biggest smile you can make. Yeah, just keep doing what you're doing. Live for me like I do for you. Now, go get some proper rest this time without all those worries, and I'll be back before you know it. <laughs> Yes, of course. I'd never forget. Mwah. I love you. And don't let anyone else tell you otherwise. They'll just be like the others. You can always trust me. We're in this together. Of course, no one has your best interest in mind like I do. 